Hello. Hello. Hello, Anne. I can hear you. Hello. Mm. Okay, I can hear you now. How was your day today? Uh, not now. <laughs> your dog is there again. <laughs> he, wants to, he wants to play with you? Yeah, but not now. <laughs> <laughs> you told him that not now? Yeah. Uh -huh. All right. So, how are you today? You did something interesting today. Did you do something interesting today? Oh, I can hear you. Hello. How about now? Can you hear me better? Oh, let me check my computer. Oh, okay. Hello. Is it okay. Can you hear me now? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so yeah, I was asking, did you do something interesting today? No, I feel in bed home and sleep. Uh-huh, you just sleep all day? Yeah. Oh, I mean, uh, I'm not so lazy. That's fine, yes. Since it's your vacation, then it's your it's your chance to what you call this to just take a rest. You're right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. So alright, can you still remember what we did last night? Um uh, yeah. I think we are still in local environment and we are talking about different kinds of handicrafts and now we are going to have a new activity again which we are going to complete the passage by filling it with a suitable word from the box but before we start can you please read the words in the box um, Attraction. Attraction. Mm -hmm. Historical. Personal. And crap. And draw. Uh -huh. So we have six underlines here. And you have to complete that by using the words in the box. Okay? Yeah. Alright. So please read the passage together with your pencil. Can I type? Uh, just read it together with your answer. Read the passage. Mm -hmm. uh, some people say that a place of interest is a place famous, but it's generally or a well known. Uh, uh, historical side. Very good. Historical side. Continue. I don't think it has to be so limited. Um, in my opinion, the place of interest is simply on that people like going to in the town the party. Uh, attraction because many people start spending time there. All people do because I am going in the park to play games there while their their parents uh sit and talk with each other. Another place of interest in my town is called market. It's um traditional market with a lot of things to see. I love to go there to buy food and clothes and watch other people buying and selling for Also, I like this market with 
because they can they can experience the culture of the man people and by women, women and other and Okay, very good. You got six correct answers. Good job. So here, listen to the speaker. Read the following. A closer look. Read the sen the following sentences after. Okay. A closer look. One. Pronunciation. Activity 5A. Listen to the speaker read the following sentences and answer the questions. 1. The craft village lies on the riverbank. 2. This painting is embroidered. 3. What is this region famous for? 4. Drums aren't made in my village. 5. A famous artisan carved this table beautifully. Okay, so now read the following sentences. Mm. The craft village lies on the river bank. This painting is embroidered. What is what is this really famous for? Some animals, but in my village, a famous artist has carved this table beautifully. Okay, very good. So, uh, where are you exactly again in Vietnam? What? Where are you exactly in Vietnam? Uh, and in this. Uh, it's a little city. Oh, little city. So, what is your place famous for? Mm, what is your place famous for? Oh, peanut cake. I don't know what is that peanut cake. Oh, I want to see for a moment peanut cake. Do you also eat peanut cake? No. Oh, I'm not up. Why no? Why you don't eat this? This is your place delicacy. Why you don't eat peanut cake? Okay. I don't like it. It's black. Oh, I don't know. Black holder. Peanut cake black. Let's see this one. This one. No, not then. Let me see. Vietnamese black peanut cake. I think they cannot see it on Facebook. Orange. No, not here. This one? No. Oh, I think I don't know that. Oh, yeah. Oh, 
Well, anyways, for you to like peanut cake. Alright. So let's move forward. What kind of food do you like then? If you do not like um, peanut cake, what cake do you like then? Thank you very much. I don't like cake very much. A closer. Okay, that's nice. Here. Can you please read this? We've spoken to you the following kinds of words. I even said, many words, nouns, effective, and books. W A P E word and negative auxiliary word start as pronoun correct position article conjunction possessive adjective in even if it is a main verb in the and auxiliary auxiliary but are normally unshared and and uh so here, just practice reading the sentences aloud. Read it slowly and try to read it carefully. Your art museum is a popular place of interest in my city. This cinema attracts lots of youngsters. Your men, the artist is more play to make traditional pop. Where do you like going to this can to end? Very good. What reading? Do not forget the and part of the okay? Do not forget the end part always. Like for example, arts attracts artisans. What? Buildings. Did you understand? Did you understand? Did you understand? Okay, did you understand? You are reading. Yeah, your dog is loud. Do not forget the letter S in the end part, okay? The letter. Okay. Listen carefully to this audio and pay attention to what, to how it's pronounced uh, the words, okay? Okay. Activity 6A. Underline the content words in the sentences. Practice reading the sentences aloud. 1. The Arts Museum is a popular place of interest in my city. 2. This cinema attracts lots of youngsters. 3. The artisans mould clay to make traditional pots. 4. Where do you like going at weekends? 5. We shouldn't destroy historical buildings. 10 times types of dependent clause. Please read this. 
There are different types of dependent costs. A fixed dependent cost of consumption is this a subordinate or also low or even low. It shows an unexpected result. For example, although she was are business, you pay the staff for the debt. Although she was start, she finished knitting the scarf of her dad. So this one, again, dependent cause of concession begins with a subordinator, although, though, or even though. All right. Mm -hmm. Pay attention to it. Although, though, or even though. It shows an unexpected result. For example, although she was tired, she finished the knitting, the scarf of her dad. Now, can you give me three examples using this subordinator? Try to give me an example using this subordinator. Although, though, or even though. You can attach. Yeah, okay. Type it. Uh, how many, how many type it? Just give me three examples. Are you done? No, I need to. Tell me when you're done, okay?
Okay, let's see. We got the correct one. Although he has a sickness, he still go out to play. Very good. So it is raining. Hard. We go to school. Even though you don't have money, you still buy a new watch. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is good. Good job. Now let's continue. Can you please? All right, this one. Please read this. A person and girl, a person speaking Greek, a super demand person, that or in other that to cause the person. Sorry. A dependent cause of reading speaking Greek, a super super demand person, because she is or else. This answers the question. Why? Example. In it's the dream they call. The cancer, the trip to China. Mm -hmm. Okay, so here in the first dependent clause, we talk about concession. It means shows an unexpected result. So we use although, though, or even though. In the next one, it is a dependent clause of reason. So we use because, since, or as. Because it answers the question, why? Did you understand? Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. So now again, give me three examples using this subordinator because, since, and as. Oh my god. It's still going to say this. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's still going to say this. Oh my god. It's still going to say this. Oh my god. 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 Okay, so I have to get the example. Yes, three examples. Oh, okay, can you repeat? Okay, again. Make three examples using because. Okay.
Sí. Because he eat too much. Because I didn't do my homework, my teacher called my mother. As if there may, are many vehicles, it gets traffic jam. Okay, very good. So, again, how many dependent class do we have now? How many dependent class we already tackle? Dependent. Dependent class of, what is the first one? First one is uh, compression. Mm -hmm. The second yeah, yeah, one? Yeah. Yeah, first one is confession. Second is um, perfect. Third is reason. And the last is. Okay. <gasps> Alright, so we are already. We already have dependent clause of concession where showing an unexpected result using subordinate or although, though, or even though. The second one is a dependent clause of reason. We use subordinate or because, since, or as to answer a question of why. The third one is, please read. A dependent cause of perfect speaking is a subordinator to that or in all of that. It tells the purpose of the action in the independent cause. It's simple to add to the more to the place so that it should make a match. So that is the purpose. The artisan molded the clay. So, the purpose is he could make a mask. Did you understand? Yeah. Uh -huh. So, again, make an example, three examples, using the dependent clause of purpose. Let's see. Oh, do you know that we experienced earthquake a while ago? Uh, 
Alright. He is so lazy that I can't stand with him. Uh huh. Is this a purpose? Mm -hmm. What is your purpose here? What is the purpose? Like this one. The, pur the purpose here is oh, okay. uh, make I a mask. Yes, make a mask. Uh, I don't know what is make a mask. To do a mask, the artisan molded the clay so that he could make a mask. Uh, a dependent clause of purpose begins with a subordinate so that, here, read this, subordinate so that or in order, in order that. It can begin, or look at this, so that it tells the purpose of the action in the dependent clause. Did you understand? Did you understand? Try to change your examples. I got the umbrella so that I can prevent the me. It can prevent or protect me from the sun. Yes, that's it. Give me give me two examples more. Give me two examples more. And the last one. I eat a lot of vegetables in order to live healthy. And the last one. I buy an alarm clock in order not to get up late. Okay, very good. So for the last one, can you please read this? A dependent cost of time living is a chocolate meter than one before after SPSS. It tells when the action described in it in the independent class takes place. Example, when I have free time, I will go to the movie. So this is another one. This is the last dependent clause of time. We have dependent clause of concession. We have dependent clause of reason. We have dependent clause of purpose. And we have dependent clause of time. The sentences begins with subordinator when, while, before, after, as soon as and etc. It tells what the action described in the dependent class. Okay, so now give me three examples using this subordinates. 
so using the subordinators three examples Examples you need to give me the subordinator. So use again when, while, before, after, as soon as, or anything that talks about when. Okay. All right. Let's check your example. Hold on. Oh. A dependent clause of time begins with a subordinate when, while, for, after. Oh, okay. So your example is correct. Good job. So again, can you tell me what are the four dependent clauses that we have? So we have time. Time is in the class. I have contact in the class. We have purpose, class, and skill in the class. We have dependent class of concession. It is to show unexpected result, reasons for answering why, clause of purpose. To show or tells the purpose of the action and a dependent clause of time to tell when the action described. So we have here underline the dependent clause in each sentence below. 
say whether it is a dependent clause of concession, of purpose, of reason, or of time. Okay, so please read number one. When people talk about Chesua, can you take the of the hobby? So what is that? Is that DC, DP, PR, or DT? D T time. Very good. Time. How about number two? My sister went to the home in case of that she could buy some like a conical hat. This purpose. How about number three? Please read number three. Although this museum is small, it has many unique artifacts. Oh, the artifacts is wrong. Concession. Although this museum is small, it has many unique artifacts. This square is our biggest place to hang out because we have space to report. Uh, what is your answer? DC? Vision. Can you type it? I can't hear you clearly. Reason. How about number four? What is this square? It's a very place to help out because we have a big box. Reason. How about number five? Five. Uh, it is the top to drive the buffalo in a long time before they make the drum head. Time. Time. Okay, so let's see if you get the correct answer. Number one, it's a DT. Number one, DT. When people talk about traditional paintings, number two, DP. So that she could buy some by so con conical hats. Very good. Number three. Oh, look at number three. It's DC, okay, DC, because we use the word although, again, although, even though, and though, we use that to tell about unexpected result, okay, so even if it is small, the unexpected result is it has still many unique artifacts so again it is a clause of concession did you understand did you understand yeah okay very good oh, oh okay. i think it's my headphone yeah i guess so i think you're really having a problem in your headset Number four, because we have space to skateboard, it's DR, very good. Number five, it's DT. So you got four correct answers, good job. 
So Anne, since it's already our time, we are just going to continue this on our next class, okay? Okay. So thank you so much, Anne, and see you again. Good night. Bye-bye. Okay,